It was the fastest five years in my life uh, ever. It's a little bit like your son or daughter when they turn five. You look at them and you wonder, when did this happen? With nearly a hundred customers and thousands of instances in production, I feel the same way about Lava Networks. It was an amazing journey for us, starting from scratch to a <clears throat> market leader position in the last five years. Uh, it's been a journey of many fuss, uh, starting from the product to seeing some of the largest deployments in India happening. I think it's, it's been an amazing journey. If I have to uh, summarize my um, five years long journey uh, in Laval in uh, five small sentences, then it will be, first one will be amazingly fulfilling, challenging, and uh, gratitude uh, for the early adopters who bestowed their trust on us. Then fourth one will be, if we truly believe in ourselves, then anything under the sun is possible. And the last one is, it's uh, a Stay tuned. Describe the journey as a journey of uh, exciting learnings. Uh, when I say learning, it is not about the you know, conventional networking technology approach that level takes to solve even traditional network problems that uh, gives birth to a completely new domain of uh, knowledge which uh, uh, which really uh, excites me. We started Laval, we knew that this is going to be one of the hardest climbs in our life. So we actually named our project as Everest. Climbing has been hard, non-stop, completely exhausting, but so far it is really worth it. Our company is growing exponentially year after year. Back in 2017 itself, we deployed a thousand plus node network, making it one of the largest deployments in the world. As of today, we are running the networks of some of the top private banks, public sector banks, insurance companies, e-commerce companies, and many more. I am humbled by the achievements that we have made so far. I am really proud of my team and all the other teams whose dedication and commitment made it all happen. Level is now five years old and I am fortunate to see this baby growing. It always gives me tremendous pleasure as the product that we build with passion, working flawlessly across diverse verticals, connecting millions of users and hence our vision turns into reality. It's all cause we take more practical than conventional approach, keeping our customers and user experience as key objective. As a result, when we see our customers delighted with our solution, it offers us immense satisfaction and that is pushing us to keep innovating to become a great company and I also believe great companies are built on great products. Four or five years back, I think we were kind of only uh, company who was building this SD-WAN market in India and majority of our customers they did not hear the uh, this, uh, they did not hear about sd wan as a technology and when we used to go to them all we used to have was our passion and the product that works my most memorable moment was our first sales order in 2016 the very first time someone decided to buy our product. Most for me uh, is the tenacity that the team has shown uh, to roll out the product, to build new features into it and expand our customer base. But most importantly, I think uh, our ability to uh, learn and our willingness or hunger to kind of learn new things, new skills as we have grown, I think that has been very inspiring to me. Well, um, if I have to talk about uh, you know memorable uh, parts of this journey, then 
in fact there will be many and if i have to uh, but there is one aspect definitely i would like to highlight that is uh, it, it gives me immense pleasure to see that each employee each individual uh, giving um, 100% to the company uh, as a leader this is highly motivating uh, for us to see that we are able to create a, a company wide culture of um, you know uh, customer success uh, one thing is creating uh, the culture and second thing is um, uh, we, are, we are able to uh, align uh, its individual to adopt to that culture so uh, in that regards as a leader uh, this is something really memorable uh, for me and for the leadership team there are many memories but uh, among the memory which is uh, very very close to my heart uh, is the uh, is the preparation of devices for uh, Aditya Billa Medula Network, they were our first customers and uh, uh, I still remember back that time uh, there were not much uh, automation uh, process and we were very few engineers both at the uh, development side as well as at the customer engineering side and uh, we really spent uh, the entire day, uh, the night and then again in the next day afternoon to bring up around 400 devices as the first uh, set of uh, uh, devices that were required to be dispatched. So we uh, provisioned those devices, uh, configured them, then packaged them and uh, uh, put all the required location stickers so that they can be shipped to the, their respective locations. And eventually when they were uh, successfully commissioned, in the Aditya Billa network and uh, once they start appearing in our uh, cloud station as online I'm sure uh, that is not only for me for the rest of all our uh, members in uh, Level family but, uh, that particular moment was the proudest and the happiest of all Level Networks is the first SD-WAN company built out of India and first to me is innovation. We innovated by understanding customer requirements, went out in a tough enterprise market, we executed well on our, our plans and here we are in the market leading position in the market which we are operating. If we continue to execute well on our plans, then the horizon for our company and for all of us is very very fast. Along the way, as our team grew, we realized as people came in whom we were working with for the first time, that we had to sit down and write our culture and values and codify them. Most importantly, know the difference. Values at Naval Networks are uncompromisable. Values are what we use when we make our most difficult decisions. Culture, on the other hand, has been evolving. We learn from the new team members who join us every year. And most importantly, we benchmark is our culture producing behavior that improves customer experience. Values on the other hand have been the same from the first day we stepped into our first office till today, five years later. What is, what is very significant is uh, we have put the customer uh, right front and center in everything that we have done and we do and uh, that has been a testament to our vision. We have a very acute sense of uh, understanding of the market, of the customer, uh, their needs and uh, I think this has kind of helped us uh, refine our vision uh, where we want to we, we want to kind of uh, connect every user on uh, any device to any application on any cloud, I think the product is a testament, the product architecture is a testament uh, to the vision and uh, the product is a realization uh, of that uh, vision that we have had. The initial the key hires uh, becomes the DNA of the company in terms of um, uh, the believer and uh, flag bearer of uh, the company vision and culture and, and they are indeed the most important um, element um, uh, in setting the company uh, culture and values. Uh, a long 
but uh, I think last year around November, I went to Kerala to meet one of the customers, and there I met one of the uh, uh, business guy from the competition. And while we met there, uh, we just started with initial introduction, you know, handshakes, uh, some sort of communication started. And before leaving, he mentioned one statement uh, that kind of changed my thought process from that day onwards. Uh, what he mentioned was. He said, "I know you are my competition, and many places when we also are working in an account, and you guys come there, uh, we kind of lose against you. Uh, but business aside, let me tell you one thing: from inside, we all feel very proud that you guys are winning, and whatever you guys have been doing, and uh, uh, we are very proud of you, and keep doing the same way." One thing. Uh is the realization that uh, productivity has nothing to do with uh, team size for sure it is it is everything to do with uh, motivation as simple as that challenges then at level was to build an ecosystem for a sustainable and scalable supply chain of world class hardware products collaborate with global odms and oems also work on cost economics to cater to price sensitive indian market and challenge global competitors yes today we proudly work with the third largest global odm and to soon to launch a range of hardware products from their portfolio For a product company, the growth comes from two areas: new products and new markets. As I see, in next five years, Laval Networks will have cutting-edge products and technologies in more than few areas, and we will be operating as a true multinational company in multiple countries across the globe without losing the edge in our home market.